Hi and welcome to this week's Something for the Weekend. I'm Tony Sales Manager here at Martin Lynch & Sons. And this week I'm going to be going through the best used items that we've received over the last couple of weeks. And there's a reason why we received some. That's because we've got the PW2s in stock. And yes, they are available. So please get your trade-ins in or if you just want to make a quick purchase, feel free to do so. Either give the guys a call or obviously order on the web if need be. And another little special for you this week. After the success of the used five code, a lot of you have been saying, Tony, 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 can you prolong it a bit? Payday's come up this week. Didn't have the money last week. Well, I'm going to keep it going for you. If you've not used the codes used five before, you just need to enter it in at checkout and that will take 5% off any of the used items in your basket. Anyway, let's get started and see what we've got. So we're going big to begin with. Kenwood's TS990S. We all know the 990 Kenwood's original big 200 watt flagship radio with the lovely screen. Yes, the screen out, the free remote control software, 200 watts, as I said, HF and six meters. Now, this one does have a box, which is great. Got double box actually, so we can ship it wherever. There's a little mark if you come around this way, Henry. So there is a bit of damage on the side there, but that's a good thing. See, normally I'd say that was a bad thing, but that is actually a very, very good thing because price-wise, £3,750. And don't forget to use that code. So that is a cheap, cheap TS990. Okay, moving across, we've got its brother or little sister, depending on where you want to look at it, the TS890S, and that's at 3300. Again, HF 6 meters with the added benefit of four meters as well. Only 100 watts and you will need an external power supply to power that 890, but it's not a biggie, let's be honest. Okay, moving across Henry, we're gonna look over here. Flexes, now I mentioned these on our last used video about the flexes. Again, I've taken some more in, I've sold some and I've taken some more in again. So we've got the 6600 available here at 2899, less than 5%. We've still got the 67, which I'm surprised that although I'm not that surprised because it's you know shy of five thousand pounds someone has to spend but this is the pinnacle of flex radio so if you're looking to set up that remote station that's a great one to go for if you're into contesting as well eight slices eight slices on that moving across the 6500 which I always used to say was the smart amateurs purchase of the 6000 series and that's at 2099 so you get four slices with this one and the rest of the information is available on our website with regards to everything that that 6500 can do. And it's a lot. It is a lot. OK, moving across, Henry, ICOMS IC7600. Very robust radio. Now, for those of you that don't know, they did actually do a firmware update on this. So it gave you the waterfall display. So even though it's an old radio, it's not really stuck in the past. You know, it's kind of giving you the benefits as you get with a 7300 or a 7610. Not all the benefits, but very, very close. And that's at 1299, 100 watts HF and six meters. Next to that, 590S. Again, we mentioned this before, one of the hidden gems of the used department. Under 800 pounds for a 590. And there's no difference really compared to the SG version. So that is a very, very smart buy. If you're into CW, down to 50 hertz on the CW filter. Okay, coming across Henry, we're going to go here. We've got these DX3000s, got a couple of those in. Great radio, down conversion, as I always tell you. So I like the 5,000, 949 pounds. Less that 5% again. A lot, a lot of radio. And if you're not too sure and you're kind of thinking, well, Tony, but it's, you know, it's not a DX10, why don't you come into the store and we'll wire this up for you and you can have a little listen and go from there and say, actually, you know what? That is a good buy. It's a very good buy. Moving across, we've got this DX Engineering NCC1. Great for phasing your antennas. Now, we'll take a little look at the back of that for those that aren't in the know. There is an NCC2, which is loads and loads of money on this. There we go on the back. All your details are there. And again, check the website for further information. Never actually use one of these myself, otherwise I'll 
could probably waffle on for hours about it as the previous owner did. But yeah, great bit of kit that, 699 and a, and a good saving on the NCC too. Very specialist, but if you know what it is, you know that's a great deal. Okay, moving across Henry, a Zygu 6200 at 675. Now you may or may not have seen the video where I took the prototype of this out, portable, um, great radio. They've done all of the firmware updates that I expected them to do, and it's now a very, very stable, portable HF radio. You're gonna love it, especially with that built-in FT8 receiver as well. Great, great fun if you're going out portable. Moving across Henry, Yesus FT450D at 599, HF and six. Again, built-in ATU, and it's a very good built-in ATU. So great starter radio or backup radio. And if you go to the right, a little kept secret now, the IC718, for those of you that have been paying attention, has been re-released by ICOM. I say re-released, it's not really true that it's been re-released, but it is back within the EU. Um, obviously they've had it in the US for quite some time. Uh, they stopped it in the EU in the UK, and they brought it back again. But it's 700 odd pounds. So you can get this one for 449. So I'd say be very, very quick if you want to grab that. There's no real difference between that and the new one. So that is an absolute bargain. Again, we've got some 705s available. Kits up a couple of those used. Uh, you're going to get that for less than a thousand pounds with the code. And moving across this lovely JRC NRD525 receiver. We've had a few JRCs in lately and they've been in impeccable condition. Great receiver if you like your old style receiver. 499 and comes with the manual as well. There we go. So Henry, if you want to try and position yourself around, we're going to go here. So we've got a 101 MP at 3599. Now these radios as used by our very own Mark and David. Yes, the dynamic duo from our latest videos. You may have seen our product videos and if you've not, Please make sure you like, comment and subscribe and you'll find more and more videos from the guys as they come along. And you can look at the old videos, which are always good. There's some great flex videos from Mark. There's one about the 890 by Mark as well, which I can recommend. Okay, moving across, we're gonna to go to a 991A. It's the shack in a box. Have to keep showing these because it's not many radios nowadays that will give you near enough all of the bands in one little box. So FT991A will give you HF, 6, 2 and 70 and C4 FM as well. So we're going to try a bit of system fusion. Again, 10.45 less than 5%. It's going to be a great way to go. Now, you may have read in the mail out that there was one radio that I really should put into my shack. Although probably the wife will say no, you've got enough radios, Tony. But I keep looking at this and it's the THD 75. So it is the current model. It's a massive saving on the price of a new one, that's for sure. 649, less than 5%. As I've said before, 2 and 70. I'm not sure if we've got any battery in this. Let's have a look. Yes, we do. And it does that HF and shortwave receive multi mode. So no matter where you are, you can check the band, see if there's any openings, get in the car, quickly rush home, start working six meters. Great, this is great. I think I'm going to get told off though if I, if I buy another one. Anyway, Henry, better move on from that before I um, do something I shouldn't do. And we're going to go down to the Ellicraft here, which is a K3S with 100 watts and it's got a built-in ATU as well. You will need to check the website with this. Uh, we've got pictures of the filters that are included. It's got quite a few SSB filters. I believe it may even have a CW filter in as well. That's up at 2499. Uh, no box, but then when did Ellie Craft ever come with a decent box? But it doesn't matter, it's in lovely condition and is ready to put on the air. You may want to get it ready for the contest this coming weekend. If you do, quickly pop in into the shop and you can at least do 24 hours on the Sunday, it's not a problem. Now moving across Henry, we're going to take a look at the 710 field at 749. And don't forget 5% off of that as well. So that's going to bring it down a fair bit. And that's a very good radio for that kind of money. That's, that's new 718 money, let's be honest. Um, just started out, I'd say grab that. I really would. I'd say grab that 710. If you're a little bit like that when it comes to used equipment and you like new, don't worry, now's the time. Because Yesu still have their cashback offer on for the 710s and you get £85 cashback off of a new one once you've paid in full, obviously. And the deal that we've got at the moment is very, very good because you get an M70 microphone 
with the FT710. So it's like 129, 130 pounds free desk microphone. So please, 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 if you want a 710, weigh it up, say, do I take the used one or do I get a brand new one? And that's for both, that's for the Field and the AEWS. So moving across Henry, loads of handhelds on offer here. We're just getting the uh, cabinets filled at the moment with some more handhelds. So we've got ID52s, we've got FT5s, ID52E again, we've got an ID51E Plus, ID51E Plus 2, some more ID52s, any tones. You know, if you want to get into DMR, an 878 UV2 Plus current model, 149. So good saving on the Anytone D878 UV plus two. Never forget that plus two, never forget that. That one's lovely and boxed as well, I like that. Uh, again, some FT5s on the top. Um, basically just give us a call. If you're after a handheld, not a problem, call any of the guys here or pop into the store and say, look, I want one of those uh, handhelds from Tony's big batch of handhelds that he's got at the moment, make an offer and more than likely I'm probably going to say yes. So handhelds, get ready because it's spring. Officially the first day of spring last week, so um, get yourself a handheld. All right, moving across Henry, I see 7300. There's not really anything I can say about 7300 apart from HF6 and 4, that lovely UI. It works, they've sold 100,000 odd units worldwide and it's brilliant. It's a great, great radio. Okay, Yesu's FT891 if you want to go mobile, HFN6. Dave's just put one of these in his car. He's put an ATAS with it, and he's loving it. it. Reminds me back in the days when we was at Chertsey, actually, and I used to do, do the same with mine. He's have an 89, uh, sorry, 857, and pop that in the car with the ATAS, and used to work loads of dicks on the way to work. So I must get back to doing that. Uh, 7610 at 2749. So we do have a few of these in, and as I've always said, and Martin's always said, we're always open for a deal. So if you see one, two, three, or four of these units in stock, and the prices are kind of like this, and you might like this one more than the other one, then please, please, please call us, and we will do you a special deal. I mean, I gave an offer to a guy on this one earlier, and you'd be surprised what the price was. Anyway, don't forget, use that use five code at checkout. Don't forget again, like, comment and subscribe if you've not done so already. Um, next week I'm going to be meeting a new amateur, which is great for the hobby, a young amateur, and I'll be filming that especially for you. And on top of that, I'm going to be doing another giveaway, but you're going to have to wait for that one. Anyway, catch up and see you soon. Take care.